the mistakes that you and I have seen multiple times is people make a good amount of money, 100,000, 150, 200, 80,000, mm -hmm. and then they go to their accountant and the accountant trying to show off, I guess, their skills and showing them that they're the best accountant in the world adds 40, 50, 60, 80,000 dollars worth of, you know, expenses. deductibles and expenses. And then they actually declare a $25,000 income or $20,000 income. Yeah, you made up 200,000, but you're saying on paper that you technically only made 20, 25 and right. it's definitely and that enough. and that can set you back a year or two of wasted time yeah. waiting for you to bring your taxes back up to speed so Perfect. so be aware if you are going to do taxes well, i'm not sure when you're going to see this video but whenever you meet with your accountant tell them that your intentions are to buy a property that year so they know not to get too excited with adding you know expenses and if you can actually reach out to your preferred lender or realtor, I'm sure they can give you tips and guidance on what to do before you actually file your taxes. Right. So definitely reach out to a loan advisor, give them your situation, and they'll give you a plan. Most borrowers aren't ready on that first phone call, yeah. especially self-employed borrowers. Yeah. So definitely reach out, reach out and come up with a plan. Yeah. Know your numbers, know your plan, so you can become a homeowner.